I look at what's going on in the big picture of this gigantic storm. The center of it is right on in here. You can see it moving through uh, Georgia, South Carolina, coastal areas, and on up to Moorhead City. It's finally going to start moving out. It's producing snow on up into the mountains. It's likely to produce uh, some rainfall for our area coming up overnight. Now, there's the overnight rain uh, from last night and earlier in the day today. But for the most part, it's been really pretty rain-free. There's where uh, throughout much of the day, and then just a few scattered showers over Virginia Beach, for example, by later on in the afternoon. Here's what's going on in the big picture uh, for our area coming up at 7 o'clock this evening. The elongated area of low pressure reaches all the way out up throughout our area and really out to sea uh, with a north, north wind on one side. And more of an easterly light wind on the other side. So again, that boundary line is going to be with us during the evening hours. 11 o'clock at night, uh, we'll start to see a little bit more of a northwesterly wind flow into the area. Some scattered showers continue. That's at 11 o'clock. Move to 3 in the morning, and that elongated area of low pressure is moving on offshore. And you'll, we've got a few scattered showers into the region and more of a wind coming up overnight and first thing during the day for tomorrow. But then by the afternoon, we see things clear off real nicely. 53 to 55 degrees, and then the wind drops off by later on in the afternoon and the evening hours. There's where we are by Wednesday morning. Fairly light winds, cool start to the day. And then after we're seeing sunshine coming up on Tuesday afternoon, it's going to be sunny all day coming up on Wednesday and 62, 63, low to mid 60s into the area coming up for the day on Wednesday. Now, Wednesday night, we're going to end up seeing another cool front drop on in with a few scattered showers overnight and first thing in the morning on Thursday. Some forecast miles do continue this into about what, noontime or 1, 2 o'clock in the afternoon. This one does not, but do not be surprised if it doesn't continue really into about 1, 2 in the afternoon. But it'll be in the low 50s again coming up for Thursday. So a little cooler, a little breezy coming up for tomorrow. But sunshine, a lot of sunshine coming up for the day on Wednesday. But temperatures in the low to mid 60s and then a little cooler again by Thursday. Now, once we get past Thursday, it just stays cool. I'm not going that cold with temperatures only into the low 40s. I'm going mid to upper 40s coming up uh, by Saturday and Sunday. Overnight, some scattered rainfall will get breezy. A cool breeze drops on in during the overnight hours and during the day some sunshine just a couple of stray showers at seven in the morning uh, three in the afternoon though I think some sunshine throughout the area here's where things are on into the evening hours we totally clear off in the evening so again early early in the morning some stray showers but not for everybody big thing is that we're going to see 54 and we'll see some sunshine by the afternoon 65 on Wednesday beautiful day uh, some morning showers really uh, during the day on Thursday and then lots of sunshine Friday but cooler coming up for the weekend.